it's uh, 6 a.m. on a Sunday, and uh, we're going to go diving today. Okay, we're almost ready to go. Uh, we're just waiting for uh, one more diver. Got lots of gear down here. Got uh, some tanks. So we're going to have a total of five divers, and plus myself. Down there, some more tanks. I'm not going to be diving today. Uh, I'm just going to be looking after the boat, which is nice. It's a nice change for me. So, a little bit less stress. So, a couple more minutes and we should be on our way. Wanted to take a quick shot of the uh, finished uh, hinge here and the gel coating that they did. The trim's all in and uh, looks good. They did a good job. So, hopefully, it survives this trip. <laughs> <laughs> I'll check it when we get back. Okay, we're on our way. Yes. Got a uh, full boat here. Bunch of folks from the Aquarium of the Pacific. We make our way over to Catalina. So, the buddy is And uh, do some diving. out here today we got uh, three foot but uh, got some four footers rolling in a lot of wind waves uh, we're almost there Blue Cavern. It was too rough for the dive stop, initial dive spot, so we've anchored uh, close to it. Anyways, uh, I went to go turn the engines off, and uh, the key broke off in the, in the uh, ignition switch. Not good. <laughs> so, here it is right here. Key's firmly stuck in there. If you can 
see that, but it's definitely in there. So can't uh, turn the engine off just yet. I want to make sure I can maneuver. So I don't know if I can turn it back on if I turn it off. But luckily, I've got a new one. So once these guys go in the water, I'll uh, replace it. I'm leaving the key and the ignition switch for now because I don't want to take the wires off and then have some other issue while we're out here in beautiful Catalina. So what I made sure I could do was start the boat <laughs> with the screwdriver, which I can. The engines will start with this uh, screwdriver. So that works out good. It's a support engine switch, so I can uh, get it started. And in the event that I can't get it started for some reason, I will then install the um, existing, or the new uh, ignition switch. Boop, boop. Uh, we are anchored. We're in, uh, anchored in about 60 feet of water. Boat's holding its own. It's not moving. And uh, I think we're good. Divers are in the water. They're doing a deep dive here. They're down uh, 100 feet or so. And they'll be back uh, after they do their skills. This is what happens when uh, got a bunch of divers on the boat. Kind of looks like a bomb went off. <laughs> Our divers are right over here, as indicated by their bubbles. They're probably in 50 feet now. They've probably gone and done their deep dive and are coming kind of back up now. This is uh, Blue Cavern Point. We're on the east side of Blue Cavern Point. The west side was way, way, way too rough. Pretty nice here though. Popping up in their dive. Nice job. Help us heading to the boat. Right now I got a uh, one thirty. That's what I got. Yeah. yeah. All right. Hey. Are we rolling? All right, we're rolling, guys. Let's go. Rolling. See you later. Rolling. All right. So, you know, I got a bunch of bubbles here, right by the boat. Do a safety stop on the way up. We do, I do it because I can see it. Okay. Good to do it for this episode. Pretty awesome uh, diving with these guys. Um, we got to get all the gear back to the <coughs> park now. Now the real fun begins. Such a fun day. Didn't start off so good with the rough seas, but uh, sure ended on a good note. The uh, two dive master students got uh, both their dives in, so that's a good thing. And apparently they did really, really well. So glad to hear that. Hey, if you like this episode, please give me a uh, thumbs up and don't forget to uh, subscribe. So there should be more episodes because the boat hasn't sold yet, so. All right, take care, bye. Smile is dream, and thoughts are clear.